Oh boy, Reddit is going to be fun today. <laughs> Yo, what's up? It's your boy Kisala, GDBT. Uh, I'm filming this before the Cyber Sunday with Logan Paul comes out. And uh, yeah, <laughs> I've been looking on Twitter. It's been interesting. You know, obviously with the response, <laughs> it's been positive, but it's also been negative. So I'm here to... <laughs> I'm here to look at both sides. Um, you know me, I'm very real. I can take criticism. Uh, <laughs> most of the time anyway. And as you can see, I've already clicked this because I, I was just personally interested to see what you lot were saying about the album. And yeah, it was very interesting. I think, I don't know, I, I still think it's too early to really decide uh, what songs you like after two, three days of listening to the album. I'd say you gotta give it like a week at least <laughs> before you just go, okay, this is what I think about the album. Everyone's kind of just rushing into the album saying it's trash or saying it's the best thing ever. And it's like, yo, chill. <laughs> Listen to it a few times. There's no rush to get your opinion out. Just, you know, enjoy the album. And then you can decide what you like and what you don't like. So yeah, a lot of the things in here, I've just taken with a pinch of salt because yeah, it's just early days. Should I do it by top? No, nah, let's do it by hot. It's a, it's a current topic. Gonna break the internet. JJ after hearing the fans were disappointed with the KSI show. <laughs> Oh God, man, people actually hate it. Shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm really intrigued to why. Oh, here we go. <laughs> why the KSI show was disappointing. Okay, there it is. <laughs> Second post. <laughs> people were told the show was going to be 90 minutes, but ended up to be one hour. Okay, well, the show was about 70 minutes, but yeah, I, you know, I put my hands up. I fucked up with the timings. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. JJ publicly said, that the show would be one time only, but he announced today that a better version of the show will be uploaded to YouTube? What, wait, what? What about the people who believed you and paid for the show? What, I didn't say this. <laughs> I didn't say this, what's, what? <laughs> Maybe I wasn't clear on my tweet. We're re-showing the show on Tuesday and Friday on Moment House, okay? It's not gonna be on YouTube. We're taking down every YouTube re-upload. Every re-upload we see, we're taking it down. Obviously, there's a lot, okay? It's very hard to try and combat it, but we are doing. And when did I say a better version of the show? Like, what? No, okay, this is, this is BS. <laughs> Cringe skits, and nearly half the artists were lip syncing in the show well, that's wrong. <laughs> All right, so cringe skits. You know what? I'll let you have some of that. Some maybe were a bit cringe, I'll admit. <laughs> some were a little bit cringe, but some were jokes. I laughed out loud with, you know, some of them. But yes, there were some like bad moments or cringe moments. Uh, <laughs> I'll, I'll give you that. Nearly half the artists were lip syncing in the show. No one was lip syncing. Not that I know of anyway. I wasn't. I 100% was not lip syncing. I said every fucking word. <laughs> but yeah, from my knowledge and you know, from what I saw, everyone was performing. There was no lip syncing, so. I'm not gonna accept that. The show was so overhyped by JJ and ended up to be a mediocre virtual concert. Well, it wasn't just a virtual concert, you know, there were skits in it. There were funny moments, etc. Yes, there were music, but it wasn't just music, you know, like compare it to Dua Leapers or Justin Bieber's, which were mainly just music. You know, I added extra to this show. So I, I don't know if I can accept that. Mediocre, that's your opinion. <laughs> That's your opinion. I thought it was dope. I mean, obviously I'm gonna fucking say that. But yeah, yeah, that's your entire to your opinion if you thought it was mediocre. Uh, overhyped, I mean, that's just me promoting. <laughs> like with the album and the KSI show, I'm going to hype it up because I'm excited for it. I think it's sick. Why wouldn't I overhype it? People tend to hype things up because they're excited for it. I was excited for the KSI show to be released because I know I put a lot of time and effort into it. <laughs> Especially to get all the musicians, all the special guests, you know the set and everything set up for this show I, you know it was just like this cool thing from me to give to you so i mean to call it mediocre it hurts but you know it it is what it is but yeah i'm sorry we thought it was arrived i was just excited for it why invite a fraud like danny bulzarian if you said the ksi show is about your life 
why didn't you invite people like Vidal that helped you to be the person you are today? Okay, you know what? This is fair. Deji wasn't involved. Vidal wasn't involved. Gujan Daniel wasn't involved. Twig wasn't involved. Uh, only OGs will understand that. No, Akin Fenwell was involved. I mean, EK, you know, there's a lot of people that weren't in the show that could have been in the show. It's very hard to try and get that many people. I, yeah, I tried. I tried to get as many people as possible. Dan Bulzerin was <laughs> very random, but he did help sponsor the show. So, <laughs> so he technically had to be there. <laughs> but yeah, you know what? That's fair. Maybe I could have done better with um, the people selection. So yeah, that's that. Uh, what else? Let me look at this. JJ coming back to his Reddit after the KSI show. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> we're not mad, we're just disappointed. Okay. Uh, so to recap, the KSI show was really the KSI concert. Yes and no. Again, I don't know. If someone can show me a concert that has skits <laughs> like I did in the KSI show. Then fine, I'll shut up with, you know, about that. With hidden fees, it turned out to be a little over 18 pounds. Yeah, I, I can't really say much about that. I, you know, I'm sorry. <laughs> Maybe it's pointless me uh, <laughs> singing to the choir right here. Oh, the angry mob, should I say. There's no choir. <laughs> The Logan Paul boxing picture was just a scam to bring in more sales. I mean, I never said I was going to fight him. I don't think it would have made sense for me to fight him, especially after he just came off of uh, fighting Mayweather. Also, I don't know if it was a scam. <laughs> I think scam is quite a harsh word to use. I didn't actively say, oh, I'm boxing Logan Paul in the KSI show. At the end of the day, it was just a picture. It wasn't like I was forcing you <laughs> to click buy <laughs> on the website. It was pre-recorded, it was performed live, but it was not live. I mean, that is every live show. <laughs> I don't know how you thought I was gonna do all of that with all those guests, Logan Paul and everyone. Uh <laughs> You know, on a live show, like that would have been, well, that's just impossible. Like I was posting pictures and videos of the show. I don't know how you thought it could have been live. <laughs> it took me two days to do. There was no way I was going to do that in 70 minutes, fam. Like I would have died. It only lasts a bit of an hour. Where's the promised one hour and 30 minutes? Well, yeah, I've already addressed that. On top of that, plenty of the people got to watch it for free because a lot, and I mean a lot of the streams were online. Look. I tried hard, fam. I took down so many, but fuck me, man. Like, there was this one guy who I think I'm getting his channel, like, banned or suspended or summoned, YouTube channel, because he was relentlessly just streaming the show. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on, man? I was just thinking, like, why would this guy with over 120,000 subscribers throw it all away just to stream the show for free. So yeah, I took down a lot of streams. I took down a lot of Discord streams, a lot of Twitch streams, a lot of YouTube streams, etc. I took down a lot, but but yeah, shit, man. It's it, it's not easy. <laughs> it's not easy taking down uh, illegal streams. I guess that's why boxing promotions struggle with it. Same with football in general. They struggle with it. So, I mean, yeah. I took down a lot, but I think it was almost impossible to take down every single one. If he was to advertise this differently, I would have loved it because in general it was good. Case I performed really well and so did everyone else. But it was just not what I paid money for. I still support you, KSI, but just do not like the approach you took for this um okay well yeah you know what maybe i could have approached it differently i'm trying to figure out how i could have approached it differently ultimately this was the first time of me doing or trying something like this and i'm not gonna get it right i'm not gonna get it bang on 100 percent of the time i mean look at the first ever song i released i think we can all agree that it's not the best <laughs> you know over time i got better and better and better so you know i'm gonna use this as a learning curve i'm really intrigued to see how much you thought this show was actually worth put in the comments <laughs> actually you know what no who's just gonna troll who's gonna be like minus 10 pounds i owe you money <laughs> for the show <laughs> constructive criticism for jj i had a couple of bones to pick we were told it was to be nine minutes but it's barely an hour I mean, it was over now, but I've, again, I've addressed this. It's the KSI show, and he said it would be about his story, but it was just a concert. I mean, there were parts of my story, you know, with Heskey, etc. but okay. Uh, and finally, shows a pick of KSI and Logan in the ring. That never, ever happened, so I'm feeling a bit 
misled by this for fuck's sake. Okay, yeah, fair, fair. KSI show described by JJ. <laughs> okay, how it actually works. Oh man. <laughs> great concert, regular show. The KSI show is gonna be great, me. Okay, just the people that pay are going to see it. Okay, oh man. It's going to be more than a concert. <laughs> Is not a lot of money for a 90 minute show. Logan versus KSI 3 may <laughs> Oh man, guys, come on. Oh, Red are having a field day. <laughs> what the difference challenge? I'm gonna shot the world 16th, 17th, 18th July. These three days are gonna blow up the internet. Corbett needs you to find the differences between this picture and this picture. They're the same thing. Okay, guys, come on. <laughs> Yo, fucking hell, man. <laughs> JJ, you took an L, but learn from this, please. Everyone after the KSI show, my disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. <laughs> fucking hell. All right, well, this has been eye-opening. Robbed harder than give versus hold her. <laughs> what? Me paying 15 pounds to watch an overhyped virtual concert with minimal skits at 4 <laughs> I think there's a lot of angry people. No, I think there is <laughs> a lot of angry people. And you know what? I'm sorry. I, 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 no, legit, I'm sorry. I thought it was sick, but <laughs> clearly a lot of you didn't. Oh my God, man. I don't know. I tried to make it a dope event, a dope show for you. And fucking hell, maybe I failed. <laughs> oh, shit. Here's our show. Only time I'm ever posting, but this needs to be said. I feel really bad for saying this, JJ, but the kids I show totally missed. This wasn't worth the money and it did not live up to the hype. Damn. Uh, I appreciate the amount of money you spend on this, but that's about it. That's <laughs> Thank you for spending that money, but you don't deserve to break even. <laughs> uh, honestly, Logan's part was by far the best part of the show. The skits were cringy, even though I could enjoy the terrible acting but it just missed the mark. Altogether, this was an L, and I won't be paying for something like this again. You finessed it. Fucking hell, so many shots! Oh, God! Okay, I'm already dead! Fuck! Jesus Christ! This is the good thing about me being able to directly speak to you guys, because imagine I was what, another celebrity, and I didn't have a Reddit. A lot of times these celebrities would just ignore it and move on and dive into their money. Whereas I'm actively taking in the criticism and <laughs> the L's and all the shit. <laughs> and uh, I guess trying to make the best out of it. <laughs> but fucking hell, man. I mean, from the sounds of it, it sounds like no one enjoyed it. Fucking hell, bro. I spent all that money, all that time effort for nothing, fuck. I wonder how many times he's going to see something like this on his Reddit video. Probably address it once <laughs> and have the rest of the post cut out of the video. Well, I, I mean, <laughs> I've addressed it the whole video. <laughs> the whole video. I, I am still so much pain. <laughs> okay, so I really finessed everyone with this pick of him and Logan Paul. Legit, I mean, I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I... <laughs> Fuck, man. I really thought I did something, man. <laughs> I really thought I did something with this show, but fuck. Bro, and I was gassed this morning, man. I was like, yo, I... Oh, I it is what it is, look. I'll take the L and I'll learn from it, man. Gonna be honest, I expected a show, not a concert. Thought I was watching <laughs> you hosting children in need. Oh my God. 15 pounds for my stream that couldn't even handle 1080p on that site. I mean, I was watching it in 1080. Okay, but anyway. And it ended 30 minutes earlier than it says for the event, disappointed. Um, okay. <sighs> All right. They really just scrolled through the Reddit and made it a show, love my fucking answer. The American Dad writers, after putting in the sixth fat neat joke of the night, I have achieved comment. This is funny. This, 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 this got me. No, this is actually funny. 
Jesus Christ, I'm getting a roasting today. I am getting burned at the stake. <laughs> I'm getting stoned right now. <laughs> the one time I didn't illegally stream it to help support someone that helped me get through a lot of stuff in my life, just to realize he overhyped it and didn't explain what it was properly. I expected better sketches considering they were done by the American Dad writers. The concert would have been okay if I knew I was paying to watch a concert for fuck's sake. Fucking hell, I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> bro but I know in my eyes, I I saw it as a show. Yes, maybe, maybe what? Maybe there was too much music and maybe not enough skits. Oh, bro. oh man. Bro, worst thing is KSI will never see this because it won't get the upvote it needs. Bro, I see it all. <laughs> I've seen it all. <laughs> I've seen everything. <laughs> I mean, at least give me props for not shying away from this. I could have easily just wait a week i imagine this would have been old news but here i am you know listening to it head on taking it all in and yeah it's it's a lot it's a, it's a lot you know it, it makes me sad it, it, it actually makes me sad because maybe this is what it's like to uh lose a boxing match or some shit like fuck you put all this time and effort and money into this thing and then you lose and yeah it sucks man <sighs> Fuck. Spot on, only Reddit can stop his ego before he joins the dark side. <laughs> the dark side. But yeah, look, guys, I don't want you to feel bad, all right? Don't feel bad. This is your opinion. This is how you feel. It's okay. This is what I want with the Reddit. I want it to be fair. You know, with the album, I want you to be fair. With, you know, the show, with the KSI show, I want you to be fair with... Anything that I do, I want you to be fair because that's the best way to be. Be truthful. We're being real and it's good. We're having an honest conversation and shit. Yeah, I took an L. I've taken an L with the KSI show. And, uh, you know, for those of you that felt scammed or were angry, I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm, I am genuinely sorry because I really thought I did something. <laughs> I really thought I did something, but yeah, fucking hell, I missed. Ah. <sighs> Yes, but for the wrong reasons. Bro, when you lot watch the KSI show next Saturday, you're all gonna lose your head. Reddit finna pop off so hard. Oh. <laughs> Top 10 tweets before disaster. <laughs> oh. Reddit vid gonna be awkward. Honestly, don't think you will do a Reddit video until... I, I'm really confused as to why you thought I would just avoid <laughs> all of this. <laughs> I, you know, I actually came on Reddit to see how gassed everyone was. Look, if, I, if I've if i taken an L, I've taken an L. I have to accept it. And uh, I can only do better. That's just it. I'm not going to just go into a ball and cry forever. Like, you know, for the future, if I do something like this again, I know how to improve it. And yeah, just make you proud. We are not mad. We are just disappointed. Expectation, uh, reality. I didn't even pay for it. And I want my money back. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, God. It's poor choice of words, JJ. You? Are you vegetarian? No. <laughs> I love on me. <laughs> no. <laughs> I love on me. <laughs> I don't get it. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, sorry. I'm just so demoralized and <laughs> broken. But I... I I don't find things funny anymore. <laughs> well, I'm laughing at my my own pain and suffering, so I guess there's, that's a plus. <laughs> Fucking hell. All right, well, that was today's Reddit video. Fuck. <laughs> Fucking hell. Uh, I don't really know what else to say. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry uh, uh, I, I pissed so many people off. Um, for those of you that paid for it and were disappointed, I'm sorry. For those of you that illegally watched it and were disappointed, uh, I'm sorry. Fuck you, but I'm sorry. <laughs> Fucking hell, this was a depressing Reddit. <laughs>
Fucking hell. Uh, shit. Oh, but maybe I could have done better with the uh, with the whole like script part. I don't know. Hmm. Maybe I could have done less music. Yeah, yeah I don't know. <clears throat> oh, I don't know. I don't know.